Well, I'll just give you an idea of how deep that one was. I've got the uh, double D on, running it in discrimination, no discrimination, and uh, that's a 20 cent piece. But crikey, that was a long way down. Almost uh, two pro pointers. Pretty impressive. Well, that's where I got the 20 cents from. And about a metre away, again just as deep, the little brother, 10 cents. Yay! 10 cents. And right here, another one. And it's an even smaller little brother. Five cents. Yay! Just out of this little area here, I've got a 20, 10, 5, and I thought I'd do up to this little embankment here. Yay! Now, not all the action's on the beach. Looks like there's a school of fish out there, which is turning into somebody's lunch. That's pretty exciting stuff. All right, back to detecting. Still working just under this little bank here. About a couple of metres away. Another nice target signal, and yep, five cents. Beauty. Another one for the collection. Okay, still working the embankment, and a little further on than that last five cents. You guessed it. Another five cents. Yay! Keep going. And another deep target, quite deep, foot, at least a foot and a bit, if not a foot and a half. There's a pile of sand that came out, and there's your 20 cent piece. So, we're certainly in the zone, and this is after all the uh, big pounding the coastline's got. So, uh, looks like I could be uh, here for a while. Yay. That's where the 20 cent was. Walk a metre, dig a hole, get a coin. Yay! Another five cents. Yippee! That's where the 20 cent was. Five cents was. And... Just walk another metre, another coin. Another five cents. I think. Yeah. All right. Okay, can't believe it. I've gone 50 metres without a target. Of any, any decent targets. Um, till now. And we're still at the uh, little embankment cutaway area. And out of that hole there, well, I've already got one out. And it's another five cents. So that one will go straight in the pocket. But there's another one over there, and I'll just uh, get some pro pointer action happening. Now for some pro pointer action. There she is. Yay! And it's a 10 cent piece. Beauty! Looks like a giant cliff face, but it's actually about a meter and a bit high. And again, just under the uh, little embankment there. Nice little target. And the reward, a dollar coin. Yay! I'll take that one. Okay, just down for the dollar coin. Beauty! Okay, another little entrance 
next to the uh, beach here. Been washed away many times, I'm sure. And out of that hole, would you believe, another five cents. It's a five cent day. Finally. Been here uh, about two hours, and I've dug lots and lots of decimals. And finally, out of a hole just below the embankment, a really old thruppence. Now it's quite, quite uh, encased, uh, and I'm going to leave it that way. But I can see the see the rim of it and make out a bit of detail. Uh, I'll have to wait till I get home and clean it up. And you know what it is, but it's definitely a thruppence, and I'm pretty excited about that. It's the first pre decimal for a long, long time. So uh, once again, never give up. They're here. I knew they were here. Yay! And just down from the thruppence, out of another shallow hole, a five cents. Beauty. The last coin for the day. Something completely different. Another five cents. Yay! Okay, looks like the birds are in action again. All the people them out there, different varieties. And it looks like they're all having a feast. And out of here, my second last coin of the day, another five cent piece. Looks like a broken record. Or a scratched CD for you youngsters. Yay! Well, that's the way back to the car, and I've made it this far, and I found two last coins on the way back to the car. But, if you believe, just near the entrance, or exit, if you like, a small sort of washed away embankment, and, you know, look, I'm poking around with the uh, double D in the grass under the under the embankment and the roots and um, would you believe I've got a very nice signal so uh, 26 24 26 and I'm sort of going well um, maybe and I've just pulled it out and you can actually see the outline of the double D and what's interesting is when I pinpointed it it was there so I got the pro pointer out right smack banged in the dead middle of where it's supposed to be as far as the pinpoint on the double D is concerned and I don't want to get too excited but I think it's a sixpence it's covered in crud um, it's got a nice edge on it I can see that there but I can't really see too much other detail so that's definitely going to go home and get cleaned up and we'll find out for real, what that is. Gee, I'm hoping it's a sixpence, so that will make two pre-decimals for the day. All right, this far to the entrance, I really have to go home. See you guys. Catch you next time. Yay! Did I mention I was going home? Well, I did, but somebody made me come up this far and just have a little bit of a look. And I couldn't, I, I couldn't go without uh, getting another five cent piece. So uh, it really is time to go. Come on. And here I am, under the embankment, again, under the grass, and <coughs> out she pops. Beauty. Another one. Definitely the five cent day. Hopefully a threepence and a sixpence day as well. Beauty! Home. I swear, 
No, I'm not going to do that. You know it's not true. When you're on a, uh, a roll, you're on a roll, and I'm on a roll. And just out of here, that's where the other five cent was. Here I am, just under the embankment, or the, uh, the bank. And that's where the Double D reckon she is. So let's just do this live. Right there. What do you reckon? You can see it. Yay! That's another entrance to the beach right there. And, you know, I thought I was going to go home empty handed. But I've got a pocket full of five cent pieces. Another one. Yay! Well, I'm on the other side of that uh, second exit and I got a five cents from over there and I've now stepped up in the world and we've gone for a ten cents. So, I think we're doing well. And it's starting to get dark so I better go. See you all. There looks nice. Maybe just another 10 minutes. Well, I almost made it to that uh, entry exit point and I didn't. Just below the uh, bank there, and you can see all the different layers of shells too. Uh, all the different tides that have come in over the years and whatnot. And I figure after all those five cent pieces, uh, it's nice to end on a high. So, out of that little hole there, a fairly shiny two dollars. So that's nice. Okay, I got the two dollar coin from over there and I turned around to come home and of course I'm swinging on the way home and I've got a nice little signal out of there and lo and behold it's another thruppence. And it's been down there a while. So I'll wait till I get home before I clean that one up and see if we can get a date from it. Pretty excited about that. Two thruppences in one day and maybe a sixpence. Yay! And on the way back to the car, for the uh, nth time, I thought I'd pick up another five cents. Yay! I can't wait to count this out.